<laughs> so it's Wednesday. I what did this what was it? We went It's been what a week now? Uh, at least what a week and a half almost to, since I uh, since I last posted. Sorry for the delay. Basically uh, in the last video it was a Thursday and the day went fine. But on the next day, on Friday, everything changed again. We uh, were getting Hudson ready for school and waiting on the school bus, but she'd been sleeping and she was um, she was she was rapidly breathing. Um, so uh, we hooked up her pulse ox machine to her, and she was she was having low low readings of oxygen. So I got her into the hospital. And uh, I actually took her to the pediatrician, and then they did an x-ray. Uh, x-ray showed that she had some possible pneumonia in her left lung, in the lower part of her left lung. So we got her checked right back into the hospital. Um, what they call a bounce back, I guess. So she was back in Friday and Saturday night, and we pushed hard and got her home on Sunday and continued to recover here at home. Uh, and that's a lot of why I haven't posted in the last week and a half is basically I've been on recovery watch with her and I just I just wasn't in the mood with with you know filming and then trying to find time to edit because I was really on top of her the whole time just watching her temperature closely watching her air repositioning her making sure she had her meds she uh you know i was i was being awake all night with her and um and 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 just just it was it was a lot to deal with and so i decided to just put the vlog to the side i i tried to film a couple of times in the last week or so i might include some of those clips in this one in this video but uh i just i really just put the vlog to the side for then guys that was four times in the hospital in what five and a half weeks in six weeks it was uh it's been it's been a crazy month to say the least uh but we're back home she's been doing really well for three or four days i hesitate to brag that she's doing good seems like every time i brag it, something else happens so uh but but she is she's, she's doing really well plus it seems like two steps forward one step back with her but we've had a pretty good pretty good week or so uh, I, I'd say the last four to five days she stayed really solid. In fact, I was probably going to send her to school on Friday, but I just wanted to make sure she had a good 36 hours under her belt of not dipping and uh, with her oxygen or, or temperature or anything. And then on Monday, uh, her teacher wasn't going to be there, so I went ahead and kept her home so that she could start her school day back to school uh, with her classmates, with her teacher. So she's currently at school. Uh, Tuesday went really well for her, so I'm hoping today went really good for her too. We'll see when she gets home. Dominic went to school today, and then when he got back, we got Hudson on the bus, and then he and I went for a really nice long walk today. Well, he went on a bike ride, I went on a walk, and uh, some, found some trails over by here that are really steep and switchbacks on them and you just pretty steep for being in Kansas. He was a little freaked out coming back so he was learning to use his brake. I was holding on to his vest to keep him from just careening down off the side of one of the cliffs but um, so that's all that's really happened today. I don't know that I'm going to include much more of anything. I, I, I think I'm just going to tack on some clips of maybe things that I I kind of thought I might start the vlog this last week, so I'll probably just add a couple of those. So this should just be a hodgepodge going forward of, of videos that, that that I took in the last week and I just didn't sit down and edit. Uh, but that's what's up, and uh, that that's probably it for today. Okay, well, her stats are doing good. Uh, when I got back in the room, they did not have her on oxygen. But uh, she was still holding it to 92 or 93 percent on oxygen. But you can see she's still she's still working pretty hard to breathe, and that's why we're that's why we're in here. But uh, more comfortable now that we're in here with some care. We know we got oxygen going. She was asleep, but uh, I woke her up because I wanted her to be awake. Because I wanted you to be awake, didn't I? Should. 
she was becoming really hard to wake up, and so I wanted to make sure we could wake up. So if she wants to go back to sleep now, it's okay. Okay? PPB. Uh -huh. Okay. It's intermittent positive pressure breathing. All right. This is a lot like a CPAP machine. Mm -hmm. It's helping expand her lung, whatever they're called, I used to know. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> help get those airways opened up a little uh -huh. bit. Grandpa has one of those. Do you know that? Did you and Grandpa got something in common. That's right. You both got awesome machines to breathe out of. Feels good, doesn't it? Yeah, tell me some more. Tell mommy that you're doing better, but we still are gonna be vigilant tonight, okay? Come on, how about a smile? Can you give mommy a smile? I love it. Show me some more, babe. What you got? You're just powering on, aren't you? Let me know you're finally feeling better, huh? Yeah. Good work. This is what today looks like. That's an Ann. Giving her water right now because I'm wondering if it's maybe a tummy ache. This is satting out about every 10 minutes. And then she come back up. It's mostly when she cries. Honey bears, honey bears, relax. Hey, I love you, Dominic. Okay, be a good boy, okay? Tell him bye bye. Bye. bye see love you, you Monday. Have fun. See Driving you the Monday. golf cart. Yeah, see ya. Hope you find some furniture. And that's basically all the footage I took for the week. So, uh, besides like some cool time lapse of a storm blowing in and some hail hitting the deck that night. So, um, so here, watch a cool time lapse and I'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> Bye. And by the way, she's doing great.